Welcome back here. I'm here with Julie Tirado here this morning. Thanks for joining us as oh, always here, you Julie. You helping me get Blanco oh, up on my lap. Yeah. yeah. Oh, I didn't even have to help you. You just hoisted <laughs> Blanco right on up there. And Blanco is a, uh, uh, he, he just went yeah. right on up there with you with a. a it, yeah, he looks looks way bigger than, you know, it's all this fluff when you it's get the, the fluff. shepherd and the collie. Yes. And, but yeah, poor thing was caught in a snare and almost snapped that paw right it broke bones and takes the whole mm -hmm. pad off it's it's pretty disgusting so yeah. he requires daily um, daily bandage and splint changings mm -hmm. and a lot of work Absolutely. i tell you we've got two or three of these multi thousand dollar dogs in our care now so then it forces us to back off from helping others in the yep. community so please when you call us you're on a list mm -hmm. because of dogs like blanco and rex and some of the ones that we've taken in that are so hurt yes. that require constant care for a month or two yeah i was gonna say yeah. you've had blanco for a while yeah. now correct sweet sweet soul yep. sweet soul loves to chew on nyla bones mm -hmm. loves his foster um, foster dog mm -hmm. friends and does very well. Yeah, but, very yeah. gentle when you brought, brought him up there and uh, just a sweet dog. Yeah. And we know it's hot out there and Blanco's oh, got a lot of fur. I know, but I know. He's going to be in the air conditioning a lot. Yeah, That's for, for sure. sure. For sure. But you have a lot of events coming up oh here gosh, to help do dogs like ever. Blanco and these upcoming pets who are yeah. going to need When you see our help. paw pantry stuff, if you're out on our site, you know, we probably have quadruple the cats than we do mm -hmm. the dogs. Yes. So if you're up around 120 to 150 in cats, we <sighs> need a lot of cat food and litter and things like that. So when oh you see that word. paw pantry on our site, that's to help us, help fosters and help people in the community. When Mark and Mary call us from the soup kitchen and, and need food, we run it up there. And then in return, they also give us their scrap meat. So sure. it's amazing how these charities it's collaboration work together. Collaboration is amazing. It is. It's all about collaboration. And then um, the the 15th through the 17th, it's just nonstop for us. We'll, we'll Luke Day at Next mm -hmm. Home. We'll be down in in Bismarck Main Street, and uh, Next Home Realty is going to have kids games and food we're going to microchip we'll have adoption mm -hmm. events so you'll see dogs like blanco there it will be there'll be big events and that's from like four to seven when our fosters so weather pending you know for yep. how long our animals can for be sure. out will be there and then on uh thursday the 17th um we're gonna have jordan's way with that is going to be Kramer. a big one that is incredible yeah tell us about incredible that incredible is beyond words <laughs> for us because we will have food there we'll have microchipping we'll have adoptables this man makes terry Wu and i look look really really <laughs> passive and quiet he's so crazy we're so excited to meet him chris chris rotunda is his name mm -hmm. and he generates millions around the nation for rescues and shelters and he's going to be in north dakota and we are lucky and blessed enough to be one of the rescues that he's going to help so you are our local inspiration oh. and he oh our national that thursday inspiration. night we're so <laughs> excited to have him on board oh. with us so dunk tank yeah. Yes. Come join us. <laughs> I, I see a hint, hint there. I see a hint. Yeah, you do. <laughs> well, thank you, Julie. Thanks, thank you guys. so much. And thank you, Blanco, for joining us. And uh, Amber, tell us uh, about this heat wave, this uh, scorcher here. We're going to keep Blanco indoors, keep him cool. Yeah, man, Blanco with that long hair might, yeah, need to stay indoors a little more today. And I love that he is a, a lap dog.